Ugh, I've got a hair in my eye. Good morning, guys. It is now Wednesday. It's nine o'clock in the morning and I'm going to do my makeup. But I thought today I would do the no brushes makeup tutorial or fingers only makeup tutorial. Fingers only? I think it's called fingers only. So yeah, I'm going to do that today. <clears throat> and then at 12, I have my hair appointment for my roots because they're pretty bad. I don't think I'm going to do any color this time. I think I'm just going to stay blonde. I quite like the blonde it is today, actually. It's quite a nice one. But yeah, just a light blonde, I think. So yeah, that's the plan. Hopefully my makeup turns out alright. I'll see you in a moment and you can judge for yourself. So I've already wiped off my lipstick, but that's what it looked like. And here's the rest of my makeup. My bronzer turned out to be a hot mess, but the rest is okay. Like, the eyeshadow could have been better, but, you know, I was using my fingers, so... I think I did okay. Like, I even did mascara with my fingers, brows, everything. Didn't use any brushes or any tools or anything like that. So, I don't know when this video will be up, but hopefully quite soon. Maybe by the time you see this, I don't know. We will see. I've got to edit my thumbnail for this look here. I don't know what photos to use, though, for, like, the main picture. Oh, that's something different. Look at you. You look so warm. I'm so jealous. It's freezing. Hey. I need to open more mail tonight too. Hey, and start doing Halloween tutorials because I'm gonna run out of time. Hamish made me lunch before my hair appointment. Yum, are you jealous? I know you are. So here's the before my hair. Here's my hair now. My makeup is looking crap. Thank you, fingers. But yeah, nice and shiny light blonde again. I decided that color here isn't really for me. I'm too basic. We put in like a little bit of a darker color as well. Like, I don't know if you can see it. Like there's some right there. Just to break it up a bit so it doesn't look too like, you know, I don't know. <laughs> look at the nice sky up there. So the place I go is right over there in Calvin Grove. What's it called? Magic Happens, I think. Next to the pizza place, next to Countdown. Countdown's just there. And then just there is that big park. So it's just in there. And I go to Mel, she's so cool. But the other girls in there are really good as well. These are satay noodles. I like satay now, which is weird because I hate peanuts, but I like satay. There you go. Sushi. Nailed it. Good morning. Got my pimple cream on again. Today I am going to do some editing this morning and then open some mail and then go to the hospital. So I thought I'd do a little bit of vlogging. Obviously there's not a lot I can do on these days and that's why I kind of wasn't vlogging because most of my day is taken up by going to the hospital but I just feel like vlogging. So I am. There's a lot of mail to open too and I need to feed Dan tonight. Look at this. Whew. All right, it's 2.14 and I got three videos ready. So almost a week's worth. Well, it is a week's worth technically, but that's for tomorrow. And then next week, I just want to get one more video done for next week. Hopefully today or tomorrow. And that means that next week I can focus on filming some um, Halloween tutorials here. I'm just going to open up all this mail because there's a lot. And then I'll show you what's inside the boxes because, yeah, that would take me 12 years to unpack it all otherwise. <laughs> I have no idea if they sent this to me by accident or if I bought this. I don't think I bought it though because I couldn't get it. But I got the bronze palette in the mail. It's so much more compact than I thought it was. It's so tiny. Like, not tiny as in, like, you're not getting product or anything. All right, Zeus. He's just dying over there, but just like very small. And I got this here, I think off um, Etsy maybe? So I want to do like a Medusa outfit. How cool is it? I also got this. Shannon. What's in here? Oh, sticky. Oh, LA Girl stuff. LA Girl strobe light strobing powder. Oh, and they sent a little light as well. Yay. Shall I swatch one? Oh no, that one broke. Shall I swatch one for you? This shade here is called 90 Watt. It's definitely pinker than what you're seeing in the camera. That's a little bit more true to color, I guess. It's quite shimmery though. So if you don't like shimmer, I don't know if you'll like these, but yeah, it's really intense. That gold there is 60 Watt. It's very, very golden and very pigmented. That bottom one there is 120 Watt. And 50 Watt at the top there. Do you mind? Have you got your pink toy? He's loving his pink toy lately, aren't you? That bottom one's probably one of my favorites. It's 110 watts. It's like a champagne, like gold and silver. 
some MAC stuff in here. Lip Tensity. What are these? Oh, these are meant to be like real pigmented, I think. Wait, do I have some of these? I feel like they already sent me some. The packaging's really cool. It shows the color on the outside, which is on the inside. There's some more of the colors and then an info stick, obviously. Super cute invite. Um, at East St. Laurent uh, event. I probably won't be able to go though because my family member being in hospital and everything and it'll probably be in Auckland. Look how cool this invite is. It's written backwards and then you look at this little mirror to read it. So cool. <laughs> Halloween costume. I want to do a Velak tutorial and a mask. This was in my P.O. box. I actually have a lot of P.O. box mail to open still. Well, again, I should say not still, again. It's all in my Porsche at the moment. The whole boat's filled up with it. I need to get it out, but I just have not had the time lately. So this is a gift from Zen Bath Tonic. Bath tea. Cute. Look, they're like flowers. Floating bouquet of rosebuds, cornflower petals, um, and organic hibiscus rose petals just for you. Add this blend and flourish, letting your mind, body, and spirit blossom in this aromatic soak. And then this one's got Epsom salts and heaps of cool ingredients in it. So thank you so much. Oh, that's really, really sweet. Thank you so much, Renee. That's such a nice message. This was in my pair box as well. Hi, Shannon. I hope you enjoy trying out our latest makeup cookies from Pony Effect. Is it Pony? Or Tony Effect? I don't know. From Mimi Box. Pony Effect. So I just had a look inside and they're just like sheet masks. So I have to try those out sometime. And then this was in the box. Oh, too, it's really heavy. So cute. It's like a mirrored box. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Okay, I've never tried this brand, but I'm really excited to because you guys know how much I love Korean makeup. Pony is a self-taught MUA turned celebrity makeup artist and visionary of the industry. It's so cool. Okay, I think I'm just going to have to open up a couple of these things and show you and the rest. I don't know. I'll see if I'll do a video on it or something. If you want to see it in a video, just let me know. This isn't sponsored or anything. It just turned up in my PO box. I have no idea why. It just did. They obviously just wanted to send it to me to try. Look at this strobing illuminator. Obviously, I've applied a lot on my hand, but it's super, super bright. Oh, so I got some on your leg, I think. The packaging is really pretty. That shimmer just there at the top is an eye stick. This looks like a liquid lipstick. Another Halloween outfit. I got the Kylie liners and some more Kylie lip kits. Brown sugar, dirty peach, love bite. And some more of these. I got sent some of these while I wasn't vlogging. Um, the fair set, but this one's the contour set. So it's got banana, shadow, fawn, and mink. I got some stuff from Elizabeth Arden, including the private show by Britney Spears and Always Red Femme by Elizabeth Arden. And then makeup galore. So I got the Privage Anti-Aging Eye Serum by Elizabeth Arden. I love the um, sunscreen after all. When I got that, I tried it out for a few days. Love it. I would still be using it, but my current moisturizer has SPF in it, so I don't bother like sticking it, but I really like it. And then this is a Elizabeth Arden Beautiful Color Illuminating Liquid Highlighter. It comes in one of those packaging types, which is like a little net, and you press onto it to get the product out. Look at that. This is in the shade Golden Kiss 01. That's the shade on my wrist. I look literally ghostly through the camera, but I do not look like that in real life. I don't know what's going on. Like I'm definitely, there we go. That's a bit more realistic. I'm definitely pale, but not that pale. These hair liquid lipsticks by Elizabeth Arden. I'm gonna swatch the lightest one. Look at this weird packaging. So you pump it and it comes through into this little like sponge. <laughs> That's the color just there. This is shade two. Daring Beige, I think. Yeah, Daring Beige. It's a really nice color. And then I'm excited about these. These are all liquid liners. I love Elizabeth Arden pencil eyeliners. So I'm looking forward to trying these. There's heaps of different colors. I got some feather butterflies off Etsy. Some starfish clips from this little um, Etsy shop here, Heaven Lucy. And that is everything. Now I have a butt ton of recycling to do. I am gonna go get ready, get dressed, wash this off my face and go to the hospital now. So I'll talk to you guys in a bit. These corn fritters are the bomb.com. I should really try to make some homemade ones though because they'd be probably a bit healthier, but they're so good.
Now I've just got to wait for the corn fritters. Yum, I add sweet chili and balsamic and salt and pepper. We're gonna go jump in bed now and watch movies, so I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.